all right we're finally back in star wars uh battlefront 2 to finish off the the uh the campaign i know there's like a second part to it that we haven't done yet so that's the part that we're getting back into uh campaign the resurrection story this is the one that we didn't play yet i've played none of this plays item versus story with the finally i guess i want to do this one i don't know I haven't played this game since I actually did the the first series, I think, because we stopped playing it not long after that. Me and my friends just by ourselves. It looks like old Iden. Also, coincidentally, well, not even coincidentally, right now I'm watching back all the Star Wars movies, like in the chronological order of everything, and that's pretty cool. I think at some point Iden does show up in the main story. It's not in the main like movie i think it was in rogue one or something that she shows up the dude dying i think it was it hask died i can't remember the other dude's name or the other name it was i don't know who was who but we still recapping hang on here comma cluster hardiga system ortega probably how it's pronounced And Shriv was fucking? Is that what he's saying? Cause his girl just said her dad, right? I don't think so. Maybe I'm missing something. I don't think it was anything like that in Star Wars where they was like crossbreeding, I guess. Uncle Shriv. I okay, cool. Big face. Oh, yeah, same here, they. Is everything okay? Where's your mom? Looking for my husband. It's good to see you, Shrev. Where's Del? I was chasing rumors for the resistance in the Janata system. Something called Project Resurrection. People are vanishing, and General Organa thinks that the First Order has something to do with it. I'm surprised when my scanners picked up the Corvus on Pillion. What did you find? Nothing. The ship was empty, and the entire planet had been strip-mined. I searched everywhere, but no sign of Dell. So I checked the ship's logs, found this. Before Pilio, Dell visited Athula, a planet on the edge of the system. Someone there must know what happened to Dad. I hope so, because it's the only lead we have. Shrib, set a course for Athula. Yes, ma'am.
notice you're back. Did you find our people up Hillbeho? Wait, you're not Della. Della isn't here. Well, did he send you to help us? Janata security has already kidnapped so many families, and we are in desperate. Someone's jamming the signal. Not a security ships. Gleb's forces. What's going on? We've got company. Shriv, I need your experience and analysis on the bridge. Zay. Look, I know this is sudden, but you're ready. Meet me in the hangar. The Athulan said JSEC was kidnapping family. <laughs> they must be here for more. We sure are. Whoa, I forgot I have to fly in this game. Okay. 
I'm fine with like the dog fighting in the game, like multiplayer. That's always cool, but in the campaign, it always feels like much. Cause it seems like I have to do all the work for these things, and it's not exactly the easiest thing to manage. Especially with how far away they be flying too sometimes. Cause I don't move way away from fighting. This one got, must have like a uh, another turn on it because it's sh still shooting behind me. That's the one that was messing me up this whole time. Hang on. <laughs> Weaponized carriers are the only way to go in war. We'll watch their fire. Stay on me. Let's take down those transports. I don't know where I need to be. One thing I do like more about that other Flying Star Wars game though is that you can, uh, we can put some speed in up uh, real quick. I don't even know if I made anything. You can like put all your power into the speed and all that. Like it really does let you control it as if you were into Star Wars. Like actually fly the Star Wars thing. Like if you diverted power properly and all that. It's a really like a uh, strategy dogfighter type of game. Which kind of makes sense since you're only in the ship. But that's what I'm saying is. You gotta think about it and just shoot. Like in this game, I just shoot, fly behind him, use my ability, move out the way, heal myself. Boom. That game, I'd have to divert my shields full to keep myself safe while I'm flying up on him. And if I get close enough to start shooting, I bet to, uh, I bet the power to weapons start doing more damage to that. And then when I start leaving, divert it to sh put the shields on the back, and then put it in speed and fly away if I got afterburn instead of them on too. Not more fun if you really get into it. Taking on some pirate type shit. Instead of actual bad guys or someone related to the Empire or something. It feels like these are pirates. The way he's talked about his uh his ship having weapons. And kinda how they have different size where's where are our ships at? Now I'm lost again. And how they have different sized ships and stuff like that. Like I know the Empire rolls around like that sometimes too, but this feels more disconnected, I feel. These ships in the Clone Wars, I think, though. These little, like, boldish ones. If I, I don't think I've gotten close enough to really see them. I'll probably just take a snap and show it up. I remember seeing them for something in Star Wars and the Clone Wars. It's like a last minute thing. You have to pull out some old models for something, because that's what they just said, too, uh, that these are older models. Okay, I finally got one. These things did not, they, they, just, they just started taking damage. Damn, I can't get my words out. And torpedoes is really what's doing all the damage, actually. Destroyed. You're not kidnapping. 
helping anyone else today, Lima Kai. Is that what you think? I have quarters to meet. If I don't fill them here, I'll do it somewhere else. I don't think so. You're not going anywhere. We need take, to I guess we're taking him out now. Trip, draw their fire, and we'll Hopefully there's you. a checkpoint here, because I'm definitely going to show up right now. Lead the way. I just used the torpedoes more that last section, then I got through it. It wasn't that had bad, actually. Damn! You finna hit me! Oh, for hut's sake, stop that! What is that? I didn't even see this the way down here. radius are slowed and their abilities are disabled for a short period of time. I forgot I turned on the fucking radio voice because we're sitting in the cockpit of the ship so that's what it would sound like if I was sitting in it. Right. So that's why I got it turned on. You need to explain that. I think it's working. Then let's keep at it. up in the engine now. And almost flew into my own ship. Right. You are trouble. I, I guess someone warned him about us and he still decided to come. I don't know why people hear a warning and think, oh, I'm just still doing it though, because I think I'm better. Chances are someone's warning you because they know you're not better. Stop that, I did. You did it. The engines are fried. Lima Kai, this is the last chance I will give you to surrender. Clint doesn't pay me to surrender. She pays me to get the job done. And that's what I'm gonna do. Fight. Lima Kai is headed your way in an N1 Starfighter. Highly modified. And he's got heavy Starfighters backing him up. I'll distract me, Makai. You take out his wingmen. They oh, wait. Geez. Too late. It doesn't sound like the right move. I feel like her daughter's gonna die. I don't know why her daughter started giving out commands. One down. Now let's see about your That bitch went down easy. I'm not gonna lie. I done just pulled up on him and shot him with some missiles. He ain't pulled no evasive maneuvers. This one doing the same thing. I'm not pulling any evasive maneuvers either, but I got a little robot that's gonna heal me. I can keep his attention also, I'm the main over. character, so it's not gonna you be that easy to kill. I don't focus. gotta pull no moves, I just gotta pull up and get the job done. I go do it, except when he's not gonna get the job done, because we're not gonna lose. Ooh, my flew into that rock right after saying that. Showed two at first, took them two up quick, and then more and more. Wingmen are down. Stay, I'm on my way. I'm hit. Tell me you're okay. I'm fine, but look out. Leave Kai circling back for you. Okay, I'll take care of him. You just get back to safety on the Corbin. Yes, ma'am. Sounds like they're stealing kids again and just, uh, 
trying to force them to be Sith now. Start that bomb. You and your eye on Paul. Oh uh, yeah, I do have one. That should deactivate the bombs before they explode. What? I just used it. Thanks, game. Thanks. Where's this dude at? He's like sitting still or something. I still can't see his ship. Oh, I guess we're supposed to chase him down through this minefoot or some shit. That was a big bitch. That was a big one. Slow down real quick, because I know you got the fucking lines. Are you really finding a straight line saying knock it off? For you. Oh, I said that off way too early. Hold up. Woo! That was close. You know what I'm just finna hit you and you go silently. Watch out back there! What is happening? Do I fly into it and pass him? Again, too. It's only kept the music, not their voices. You know, I only took this job because it was supposed to be easy. Steady pay, hot food, a minimum number of people trying to stab me in the back. In this line of work, that's practically retirement. You are ruining my retirement! He just said that he was warned about us, so he knew this wasn't supposed to be easy. Again, I don't know how you can be hearing warnings and then thinking that you're gonna be okay. Doesn't make any sense. My missiles, my torpedoes just circled all around. Yeah, bitch, I'm gonna fly through your smoke puff too, like you're doing the movies. Oh, that was close. I take down their leader and they just give up? I may have told them that we were prepared to fire all of our concussion missiles at once. Zay, the Corvus never had missiles, you know that? Yeah, well, they don't know that. No, they don't. That's hilarious. Nice work, soldier. That's not all. They gave up everything. Gleb scooped up Bell when he stumbled onto Project Resurrection. Where is she? You're not going to believe it. Alright, so Geb was the person that we had to save in the last mission, I remember. Hopefully this little crackling noise I'm hearing isn't coming through on the recording. So I don't know what it is. Anyways, I know Geb is someone we had to save. He's deep in the piracy world, I believe. all right thanks for watching i'm gonna call the video there i don't want my videos to be super long like i used to do because honestly no one has time to watch a 40 minute video because i barely get through it myself even if i want to watch it so thanks for watching don't forget to follow my twitch and my other socials in the description down below uh don't forget to subscribe and i'll see you next